The Duke and Duchess of Sussex introduced their newborn to the world last Wednesday, in front of selected cameras at Windsor Castle. As Harry held little Archie in his arms, Meghan described having a baby as magic and added she has the two best guys in the world. The California native's life has changed so much since she married into the royal family last May. In only two years, Meghan transitioned from being a Hollywood celebrity to becoming a duchess and a mother. However, being married was not a first for the former actress. Meghan was married to film producer Trevor Engelson years before she became a member of the royal family. The two married on September 10, 2011, at the Jamaica in Inoko Rios, Jamaica. The wedding was a four-day affair and pictures have since shown drinking games on the beach in the run-up to the big day. The couple separated just two years after their wedding and were divorced in August 2013, citing irreconcilable differences. In 2019 Channel 5 documentary Meghan Markle, Movies, Marriage and Motherhood, Royal Correspondent Ashley Pearson said, they were together for seven years, married for two. The problem with the marriage was the distance. As soon as they married she got the gig on Suits and she was in Toronto and he was in Louisiana. The relationship just didn't last. Trevor remarried last weekend to the heiress of a multi-million dollar empire, almost exactly a year after the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's royal wedding. The 42-year-old proposed to nutritionist Tracy Curland less than two weeks after Meghan and Prince Harry married at St. George's Chapel, in the grounds of Windsor Castle, on May 19 last year. Tracy is the daughter of Stanford Curland who made millions riding the loans linked to the 2008 housing crash. Photos from the wedding this weekend show the couple kissing during their first dance at the hotel.